Hey guys, it's Rhiannon and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be telling you guys what I eat in a day. So for breakfast, the first thing that I had was a sausage bagel. I started off by getting some sausages and cutting them in half just so that they're easier to cook. I toasted my bagel, put a little bit of butter on it. I also made myself a nice cup of tea for the morning with a little bit of sugar and I went upstairs and I enjoyed my breakfast. Summer colognes got me falling to my knees. I don't need much, baby. I just need you right here next to me. Oh, hello. Um, okay, let me go over here. Okay, so I'm sorry that the lighting is really bad, but this morning we haven't got the healthiest breakfast, but it doesn't really matter because it tastes good. A sausage and barbecue sauce bagel. And I didn't actually show you guys what tea I'm having, but it's pretty boring. Okay, I can't deal with this. I didn't tell you guys what tea I'm having. I'm literally just having normal English breakfast tea, so. It is lunch time. Lunch, I made myself some really nice sweet potato fries. I make them kind of weirdly. I just like cover them all in oil with a little bit of cayenne pepper and some all-purpose seasoning. And I shake that about and then I put them in the non-stick pan and just let them cook. Now would this really be a What I Eat in a Day by Rihanna and Arthur if there was no salmon? <laughs> so my friend is literally going to hate me for the fact that I have salmon in this video. But I started off by washing my salmon because you want to make sure you get rid of all those like, pesticides or whatever they are. Um, I do that. I put honey, a bit of seasonings. I don't remember what I put in to be honest. Then I also steamed some broccoli and I put that on the side and that was my lunch. Okay guys, so I'm in the middle of my Spanish lesson. I kind of fancied a snack, so guess what I did? I went and got a snack. Tortilla chips and hummus and I'm eating it in my room because I'm in the middle of a lesson. <laughs> So for dinner, I'm making sweet potato with like not grilled chicken, but like kind of like just sauteed, sauteed chicken. I wash the sweet potatoes and then I just poked holes in each one of the sweet potatoes with a fork. So now I'm gonna put those in first because sweet potatoes take ages to cook. One little tip, that's probably not a tip, I hate chicken juices. So what I've like started doing is getting tissue and just like putting the chicken in the tissue so that it like dries off. I've got some chilies and we're gonna put them in the chicken. purpose seasoning that has loads of stuff in it this is what I use pretty much for everything that I make okay hello that is not a very nice sight I basically finished my seasoning thingy magic I don't know what I'm calling this to be honest I'm gonna use the same knife because it's not like I'm using meat to veg I'm using veg to meat so that's absolutely fine this is pretty self-explanatory I'm just telling you guys how I do it slice it in half I'll just dice it like this I don't want very small chunks. Sometimes I do chunks smaller than this, but today I'm not really that bothered. I have a bowl to the side of the camera that you can't really see. All in. Um, I'm pretty 
pretty sure that my sweet potatoes are almost done. I think I'm gonna leave them for about 15 minutes and then I'll be back and cook my chicken. I hate the fact that you can literally see all of my flaws. That's cute. Oh, it smells. Please can you tell me that that doesn't look good? Because you're lying if you say that it doesn't. I fancy a snack. I know that dinner's literally, literally five minutes from being ready. I kind of fancy something sweet. And if I want something sweet, I'm not gonna stop. So the other day, we bought rice cakes and I wanted to try them with almond butter. So this is how the like obsession started. I liked it, but I didn't because it wasn't very like, there was nothing special. I thought that almond butter was gonna be sweet and it's it's not. I didn't like it and I was like, okay, I'm not gonna waste this almond butter, so let me just try something else. And I thought of like peanut butter and jelly in America, which is basically just peanut butter and jam. Rice cake, rice cake, almond butter, honey, black seeds and then I got frozen berries and put them in the microwave and just like made my own jam. It was so good. When I tell you it was good, it was like beautiful. It was so good. I'm gonna have an apple with almond butter. People rave on about it. I've never tried it so I'm gonna try it now. Oh god. Do you know how long it's been since I've had an apple? Oh my gosh, it's so good. This apple's really good. I haven't forgot about the chicken, by the way. I don't know whether everything tastes better when you're hungry, or if it's just because I haven't had an apple in probably over like two months. But that apple was really good. I'm not being dramatic. Maybe I am being dramatic. Let's give it a try. Guys, I'm not gonna lie to you. It's not it. It's really not. The apple. Marvelous, which I've made very clear. I don't count calories or anything like that, but it's just extra calories for no reason. I don't think it adds anything to the flavor. Let me actually feed the rest of my family now. Oh my, look at that. I've got to give it a little bit of color, do you know what I mean? Put a few tomatoes in there, because health. That was the dumbest idea. Why did I do that? Why did I actually do that? I should have cut the tomatoes in half at least. This is what the chicken is looking like. That looks absolutely great. Oh, that looks horrible. This is like one of the worst dinners I've ever made. Let me not lie, the chicken does taste good. Okay, so this is really annoying because I really didn't want this to happen, but when I was editing this video, I only just noticed. I made sweet potatoes twice in that day, and I apologize because it just seems really boring and it doesn't seem like there was a lot of variety. I tried to film on a day where I had like good meals, but dinner wasn't really that great that day, which is unfortunate. I hope that you guys don't mind, and I hope that you pretty much enjoyed this video. Also, later on at about midnight, I had a celebration. I had a Maltese celebration and a Snickers celebration, so yeah, I didn't film that, but I was just let you guys know that i ate that but yeah that's pretty much what i ate for the day um i really hope that you guys enjoyed this video make sure to like this video if you like this video subscribe to my channel if you haven't already if you enjoyed it and i'll see you guys next time bye